In this big world of opportunities, amidst the everyday hustle and bustle of life, we are boggled down with so many questions. Where do I go? What do I do? How do I get there? What do I do when I get there? Is this going to help me? Will I ever get ahead? Is it ever going to get easier? Is this the right choice? How do I know what to believe? Who am I? Why am I here? What is my purpose? Does anybody hear me? And then the breakdown. You're alone, tear-drenched eyes, blood-wrenched heart in a dark place where nothing exists. And then there's light and a small voice that says, I've always been here, take my hand. And just like that, you're endowed with a peace that surpasses all understanding. You no longer feel alone. You can feel the wind beneath your wings. Your tears have dried up in your heart. It's pumping life again. And now even through the hustle and bustle of this big busy world, even though questions still arise, you now have answers. The picture is clearer. Your life now has purpose. And that my friend is what it looks like to fall down, get back up and begin walking in a purpose-filled journey. Sadly, it doesn't always happen that way. Many people live and die without ever finding their purpose, without ever really just enjoying life. And the purest form of life is living in purpose, on purpose. So let me ask you a few questions. Number one, are you living or are you living? Are you thriving or are you striving? Are you walking in your purpose, on purpose, or are you grasping at mirages that look like purpose only to be disappointed again? Well, look, everybody has goals, visions, and dreams. And uh, whether it's physically, mentally, socially, uh, uh, spiritually, or even relationship-wise, we all have goals. We just really don't reach our goals. And there are two main reasons why. One is because we don't know how to set our goals, let alone carry them out. And that may sound simple and practical, but think about it. When is the last time that you set a goal and you went through the hustle and bustle to get to that goal and then actually reach that goal? See what I'm saying? Goals are a process. Setting goals and reaching goals, it's a process to it. Number two is we go at it alone. We try to do it all by ourselves. We all face the fact we all need motivators we need someone to encourage us we need whenever we're weak or we're down not feeling quite uh, ourselves or under the weather we need someone to lift us up and even the book good book says you know that treasure book that uh, teaches everybody how to have a prosperous life in every area of their life well that book even says that people perish for lack of knowledge and also that two are better than one so here I come with knowledge from my experiences as well as the uh, spiritual wisdom that was gifted to me by God to reinforce what he's already planted inside of you to get you where you need to go. So let's have a free consultation on me, one-on-one, uh, -on -one, mano y mano, and try to get you on your pathway to purpose to, so that you can avoid constantly grasping for those, for those uh, mirages that look like purpose but yet walk in a purpose-filled, meaningful life. Thank you so much for your time. God bless you, and I hope to speak with you soon.